Okay, mama. Shh. You should know the truth. And the truth. Oh, comes up. This morning, we will be speaking on speaking our truths. Uh, the verse says, if Christ is truth, uh, then it falls that lying is moving away from Christ. Yes, speak that, Pastor. The more we fall. Sister Delala, come on up and let God hear your voice. Joyful, joyful, Lord, we adore thee. Yes, little lady. Hi, I'm Coco. Uh, thank you for having us today. Mm -hmm. How sweet is she? Uh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Um, I stand before you all to let you know that my mama has a truth to tell. No, no, I don't. <laughs> uh, uh, yes, you do. No, Coco, sit down. I don't. Yes, you do, mama. Tell them. No, there's nothing to tell. So we're just going to act like you didn't kill her. Kill who? The squirrel that you ran over with your car and left his body there. <laughs> Coco, when we get home. <laughs> oh, oh, my. Oh, poor baby must have been traumatized. Um, well, all right. About this sermon. Yes, let's get back to the sermon. <laughs> oh, oh, wait. And guess what, Pastor? Mm -mm. That pretty little hair that you see on her head, that's not hers. Tell them about the jail braids under your wig, Mama. Show them. Take your wig off. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Continue, Pastor. <laughs> <Sit down. laughs> uh, amen. Mm, come in. Mm. Uh, good morning, Mama. I went downstairs for breakfast. I didn't smell anything, so I was just wondering, did you forget that you had kids? <laughs> no, Coco. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm a little sick this morning. I don't know why I feel so weak. <sighs> Mama, no! Mama, no, please. I need you without you. There's no me without me. There's no you. It's Coco with Mama for life. <laughs> no, relax. I'm not going anywhere. It's just a little bug. I'll be better in a few days. Oh, okay. Well, you just... Lay down, okay, mom? I'm gonna take really good care of you, okay? Here, I'm gonna cover you with this one. There you go. I love you, Papa. Thank you, baby. I love you. Love you more. Oh, my poor mama's so sick. Made her some tea. I hope it's warm enough. Yeah, it feels warm. It's a little cold, whatever. Ugh. Oh, it's probably because I didn't plug it in. It's okay. Okay, I'm going some tea. It does so good. Because mm -hmm. I know she don't want it to be extra sweet. Because don't nobody just want no regular tea. Mm -hmm. Oh, it looks like it's steaming. But that's the sugar. <sighs> okay, this should do it. She's going to be so happy. She's going to feel so much better. I give her some medicine. Enough. Just full, full of sugar. I'll make the medicine go down. The medicine go down. The medicine go down. What? What? Hey, Mama. I made you some tea. Oh, that was sweet. Thank you. You're welcome. Here you go. And take all of these two, okay? At one time and make you feel better. Oh, oh. Honey, I can't take all of these at one time. It, it'll make me feel worse. Oh. 
Oh, but you didn't know. It's okay. I'll I'll take one. The one that's for colds. The, these are the ones that have mom on the toilet. Cause yeah, you be stinking sometimes. <laughs> it's natural. Uh yeah. Natural for an elephant? Shouldn't nobody be smelling like that? Smelling like the world's largest zoo. Really, Coco? Really, mama. It's nasty. <laughs> Oh, I'm about to win. Oh, 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 I'm about to win. Oh, I'm about to win. <laughs> uh, people keep calling on trying to play my game. Decline. Uh, she calling again? Decline. Uh. Hi, TT Dana. Hey, Coco. How are you? Uh. I'm good. How are you? Trying to play my game. I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. Can I speak to your mom, please? Oh, uh, she's not here. What? She's not? Well, who's there with you? It's just me. And I'm so hungry, TT. How long have you been alone, Coco? Uh, like eight. Like eight? Okay, okay. Put your hands down. But did she say why she was leaving for so long? Uh... I'm not sure, but we could chat for a while. <laughs> okay, I'll talk to you. Now, what you over there getting into? Well, I was playing my game, but you kept calling and I kept declining, but you kept calling, so now I guess I'm talking to you. <laughs> well, excuse me? No, no, I wasn't saying it like that, TT. Just next time, don't keep calling, okay? Good. Kid, you can come over anytime. Well, Coco is in the living room. You can go join her, okay? Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> oh, great. She went upstairs. Hey, kid. The name's Coco, as I told you 45,000 times, Tony. You know what? Just call me Constance. Yeah, well, I like kid better. Let's play. Not interested. Okay, cool. Let's play two for there. Why does everybody think you're so sweet? I don't even understand why my mama lets you come over here. Go home. Because I can. Hey, how are you two doing in here? Oh, we are great, Mrs. Trudy. Thank you so much. Can I help you with anything? Mom! Oh, no, thank you. You are just so well-mannered. Okay, I'm going to go back upstairs. I'll check on you all in a bit. Do that so well. Truth or there? Truth. Is it true you were adopted? No, Tony. I'm not gonna tell you again that I am my parents' child. Just because my head is a little bigger and my personality is a little wacky, that does not mean I'm not theirs. Next. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Stop. Truth or deal? 
dare. I dare you to tell everyone how mean and bad you really are. No, I'm not doing that. I make the rules. I'm the leader. What? The leader of what? You in my house. Yeah, whatever. You do what I tell you to do. Now your turn is over. Um, what is going on here? Go ahead and tell her, Tony. Oh, nothing, Mrs. Trudy. I was just trying to play with Coco. She was just being mean. What? Well, Tony, that is not what I just witnessed. Yeah, Mr. Judy, it was worse. Coco and... Wait a minute. Mama, now I know a lot of times I do stuff, but this time I swear it was here. Swear. I know, Coco, I know. Look, Tony, I saw what I saw. Would you want someone to treat you like that? No, but everyone does that at my school. Everyone is mean to me. So you don't like it. So why would you treat someone else that way? I apologize. I just thought it would make me feel better. Now I know how it feels. I'll never do it again. Friends? Friends. Thank you so much, Tony, for apologizing. <laughs> yep, and now you can get out. Coco! Huh? I mean, what time is mama coming? <laughs> Don't worry, baby zoo. I'll take care of you. I know Miss Betty hasn't been taking good care of you. You can stay with us. Come on. Mama? Mama? This is my house. Uh oh, well, uh, excuse me. Freeze. Uh, I'm not really trying to play freeze tag right now. What is that? What's what? Under the blanket. Huh? Oh, you talking about under this blanket? Oh, this is just baby zoo. Um, I got him from across the street. Uh, we gonna sit right here. You don't have to ask us any more questions, okay? Bye, go upstairs, my bye. Uh -uh. <laughs> Let me see what's under the blanket. Coco, if you took something from somebody's house and bought it in this house, we're going to have a problem. Um, well, it didn't exactly come from in somebody's house, but uh, it still may be a problem. Coco, let me see. Baby Zoo, Mama, Mama, Baby Zoo. Baby, who is that Miss Betty Zucchini that she's been growing this whole season and it still had more time to grow? So enjoy your moment because we're taking him back as soon as Miss Betty gets home. She just doesn't understand. It's okay, baby Zoo. Maybe mama will forget about you. Let's take a nap. Oh, great. She's sleeping. Okay, perfect time to take him back. Whoa, what are you doing? <laughs> Did you just talk to me? Uh, yeah, because you're grabbing all on me, and I don't really know you like that. What? Coco, wake up! Wake up! Wake up, Coco! What, huh? Yes, Mom, Zoo! Zoo, baby, Zoo, you okay? It's okay, I'm right here. I'm right here. Nobody gonna take you. What's wrong, Mama? Your zucchini just talked to me. Yep, sure it did. Uh, Mama, you feeling okay? You need to take a nap. You want me to call daddy? Yes, call your daddy. Your mom's was trying to take me away when you told me I could stay. <sighs> Mom, Mom, get this thing. Mom, get it. Uh, no, 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 no. You just thought I was crazy. So you can take baby Zoo back to whatever magical garden you got him from because I don't want to touch him. I'm done. I'm done. Since you could talk, then you could walk your jolly green giant self out that door back to Miss Betty's garden. Cause I'm about to pass out. Do you believe in me? Of course I do, Coco. Well, I want to be a singer when I grow up. Okay, well what kind of singer do you want to be? If I should stay, I will long. Leave me your way. Okay, so you want to sing like Whitney Houston? And so I'll go. And yeah, I know. I think of you every step of the way. 
uh, that's a good start. <laughs> Liked it, Mama. It was pleasantly surprising. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna sing it in the talent show because I sound just like Whitney Houston. I don't think you should do that. You know mm. why? Because you know you just have so many other talents to show the world. <laughs> Mama, so you really just gonna sit here and tell a story? I know I can't sing. I was just playing. What else you been telling stories about? One plus one, not two? It's two plus five, not three? It was never three. I know, it's seven. I was just testing you because I don't know what to believe anymore. Oh, Coco, you look so cute. I just love picture day, don't you? Yep, 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 hooray. <laughs> Smile, Coco Puffs. The pictures are gonna come out perfect. Yeah, well, I hope they do after all this torture you put my head through for this hairstyle. And it's perfect. Coco, please do not mess up your hair. Your pictures are being taken at the beginning of the school day. Okay, mama. Well, hopefully these kids hurry up, smile, and keep it moving because I'm ready for my pigtails back. <laughs> you are so silly. Coco, you are one of those kids. Okay, go ahead and go in and I'll see you later, okay? Love you. Bye, mama. Bye. <laughs> You don't look too bad yourself, but you could have fixed the side of your hair a little bit. Well, excuse me. This was the style that I was going for. But anyways, luckily you get to go first today, so that way you don't mess up your hair. Oh, it's cute. I, I like how you're missing a seashell and how it's a little lopsided. You know what? Go stand over there for a second, and I'll let you know when it's your turn. Okay, thanks, Miss Tiger School. Finally, a mirror. Mama got me out here looking like little Miss Rosie. I'm gonna fix my hair. I'm Coco. They can't smell my foot. They can't have my heart. I'm gonna do my piggy tails. I love my piggy tails. Cause I am beautiful. No matter what they say, words can't bring me down. Oh, 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 oh. Mama want my hair be fancy, so I make it a little fancy. I'ma tease it like I saw in those videos that the girls be doing. Did, did. Okay, I'm cute. <laughs> All right, kiddo, I need you to strike a pose. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Tease. All right, Coco, you're up. Stand over there. Your mama's gonna be very disappointed in you. Now when she sees this smile. All right, next person can step up. Okay, Mr. Photographer. All right, you ready? Say cheese. Whoa, kid, what, what happened to you? You look, you look horrible. horribly creative. You, you look pretty, baby. You look pretty. I hope my mama likes it as much as you. Right, that's what I meant. All right, here we go. One, two, three, say cheese. Cheese! <laughs> here you go, Coco, your pictures came. Thank you, Mrs. Tiger Stool. No problem, I'm sure your mother will be very surprised. Hey, Coco, how was school today? Uh, hey, Mama, it was good. Uh, Jeremy was in the lunchroom picking the jam out his toes, but other than that, nothing major. Uh, your pictures came and I opened them already. Huh? That is gross. And what pictures are you talking about? The ones that you forced me to take. <laughs> Coco, I did not force you to take anything. Now pass me that picture. I'm so excited. I can imagine how cute you look. Let me see. 
this you like what happened wow are they that pretty they must be perfect coco why your hair and your clothes were so pretty that day what is this and where's the color who, who, who is that you it's you this is you that's who it is oh but mama mama did you see my bang yang it's beaut now now coco you know that's a no-no every time we turn our heads you're always into trouble we're pretty night night jordan night night daddy mama guess what what coco um 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 uh coco what spit it out We just went to that fancy restaurant last week, Coco. Oh, that was me. Uh, well, tonight's different, Mama. Mm-hmm. And that's why you're not going. So what am I going to do? Ari and Rhea are still gone for the summer and Daddy's still in the army. Well, you, my dear, are going to bed and the sitter is going to watch you. What? Sitters don't even like me. <laughs> they love you. Excuse me. Uh-uh, no pouting. That's that. Come on, let's get you in bed. Get in. He about to go now? Yes, Coco. <coughs> Girl, cover your mouth! <coughs> Mom, what? Mom, I think I'm sick. <coughs> um, I think you're not. Stop faking. You were just running around here having fun. <laughs> child you all are my favorite children now go to bed ma'am i'll see you in the morning do we like this mama wait can we talk about this for a minute nope good night wait wait you got a hole in your outfit mama go to bed I swear, she'll never let me go no place with her. She says it's girls night. I'm a girl. It's nighttime. It's night. I just want to go too. But I'm not even going to go to sleep. I'm about to stay up as long as I could possibly stay up. I'm up. I'm still up. I'm because it's up and it's up and it's up. Come on, Coco. Go, go, go. Come on, Coco. Okay, coming. <sighs> oh, mama, it is beaut out here. Listen to the boys chirping. 
the trees are just blowing the grass is so green it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood a beautiful day in the neighborhood won't you be mine won't you be mine uh-huh yep i mean the weather is perfect i wish you could stay like this all year round go 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 You're struggling. Let me give you a hand. Oh, thanks. No problem. You gotta be more careful. You don't want your back to give out. You know, after a certain age, doctors say that you have to watch yourself. <laughs> yep, and at a young age, you better watch your mouth or you won't have a place to stay. some of the stuff out the car but you had grabbed it all but um you, you think I can come back inside your house because as much as it's nice out here I get to eat up a meal now now Coco you know that's a no-no every time we turn our heads you're always into trouble with pretty pigtails and a smile that makes us giggle what can we say that's just Coco being